Three, two. <laughs> <laughs> this is a very serious project here, Tim. I know. <laughs> hey guys, welcome back to more geocaching here on GeoDudes. Jason here with a very, very special guest, my good friend, Tim T Mac. Give your geocaching name now, hey, T Mac. Am, am I T Mac? You are now. I am. It's high school days, man. Okay. We'll, we'll, we'll go with it. <laughs> I'm up hanging out with Tim. How you been, buddy? Hey, good man. Fresh off the plane from Japan, and uh, yeah, he goes to Japan. We, we gotta gotta make a video here. A few videos. A few videos. It's not just a. It's not like a normal day of geocaching here. No, it's but not gonna be. Let the viewers know where we're at. We uh, drove from Phoenix. We're up in Sedona right now. Red Rock Town. Red Rock Town. <laughs> yeah, it's. Uh, I don't think I've ever found a geocache in Sedona before. Well. Let's change that. and yeah. uh, We're going to go check out some cool spots, uh, hang out around town, both have the day off, and uh, get some beef jerky, too. It's a good beef jerky place up here. There is. So uh, let's go uh, hit up our first cache of the day. We are starting at a parking lot of a Mormon church. And uh, luckily, I think we avoided the hill climb because everyone's writing about that they had to climb significantly high to get to this cache. Yet I thought ahead of myself, and I was like, at the top of the hill is a parking lot. That's probably a good way to get to the cash. Because we're we're going easy. We got we gotta go the easy way. Yeah. Okay. There's the there's the there's the hard way and then there's the geodude's way. The geodude's way is way better. <laughs> so let's not waste any time because it's starting to rain and uh let's go find a cash. Do you wanna try to find it? No? You wanna? Okay. Alright, let me set you up here. Don't go off the cliff. Okay. There you go. Alright. So Follow the dial. Let's go. Lead the way. Whew. Muddy. Alright. I don't know. Why am I leading? I don't know. I don't know where I'm going. <laughs> geo, my geo instincts are. Alright, once it gets to about 15, 20 feet, uh, you're kind of basically in the re realm. Yeah, like. Start looking, where would you think it'd be hidden? Like, what now looks like a good... Now it's only... Two-tenths of a mile? Two -tenths of a mile. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what it's... It's been doing that to me, like, the last, like, three or four times I've gone out. So it's just... We're, we're probably close, so... So it's in this general... Thing. Yeah, where, what looks like a good spot that could be a hide. Gonna look for... Oh, it's a ammo can, so it's pretty big. So it's gotta be under... Oh, it's buried in, like, some rocks. Yeah. Some moved up rocks. Maybe here? Right here. Oh, look at that. Look at that. All-star. Nailed it. Yeah, ammo can's the best. Look at that. The pull. There we go. Look at that. Goodie bags. And a card. It's easy information. Yep. Yeah. Oh, snap. Oh, great. We can listen to some tunes on the way home in my cassette player. <laughs> wow, Ace of, of Bass. 90s. Send log. See, the first person here was 2010. Oh, so it's been out here quite a while. Just over nine years now. Just hit its nine oh, year it's anniversary. Nine, it's in, just past nine years, yeah. Good job, Tim. Thank you. Found it. It's a good size cache to come up for. And we didn't have to hike the hill. <laughs> <coughs> All right, that was a good find. We're gonna wrap this video up because we're gonna make 18 videos today. And I need content, so I'm gonna separate them. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, that was a good quick find. 
Uh, good way to start the day. It's a good way to start the day. We're gonna go and find another place. We're getting rained on. And uh, see you next video. Till next time, Jason and Tim. Next video, crush the cash. Say, say crush the cash. Crush the cash. Say crush the cash.